Hey everybody, PKO Gamer here. I'm going to blame my good buddy Cyrus Martin here. <laughs> he got luck. He got some really cool stuff. He got a, uh, a Neo Geo AES, and uh, in the mail, and I think that's awesome that he got something like that. And uh, I, I've emulated the Neo Geo for a while. This is one of my favorite games of all time, Sengoku. It's the arcade beat em up that I'm okay at. And uh, it is a quarter muncher. It is made to take your quarters constantly. And I, like I said, I'm emulating. He's a lucky, lucky dude that's got now. And he's on AES home system. So I'm going to play this for you. This is one of the games that was in a Walmart. I mean, I play Mortal Kombat, I think, here. No, no, actually, Mortal Kombat was somewhere else. Uh, Final Fight here, Street Fighter 2. Uh, show, Samurai Showdown, Fatal Fury, and this game. Man, I, that that Walmart had had some pretty good games on it. This is a really interesting uh, beat 'em up. It, it, it is very mean. It, or I I think I got to stage three. I don't know how far I could, how far I could get. I could beat the game, but uh, since I have on left, it continues. But it is a mean game. But it's it's the if you listen to it, I'm gonna shut up here. The sound is awesome. Dang. But uh, it always has some really interesting. This is the Japanese version. The English is. It's like he says, hey, I'm going to help you. And pretty much, you know, it's nothing major. But uh, you get these orbs. See, he gave you energy to be able to shoot stuff. And I like this guy. This red jacket, the yellow pants. He just looks almost screams 80s. And it's really cool. I mean, this is a. This is when, you know, I think around similar time of Final Fight, it's just a different style. It's Neo Geo. You know, it's big time. The games are bigger. And, uh, I, the, the sound is awesome as hell to me. And uh, I always remember just being, just being so damn cool that it ate my quarters. I can get through the first level with dollar, uh, probably a dollar or so of quarters. I'm getting bit better at it again because I remember how to play it. And it has a lot of cool scaling like that. This big old guy. It's, and it's really Japanese oriented. I mean, I know it's Dutch, Japanese, but really it's, 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 you know, maybe this is what a guy over there looks like if he's trying to dress like American or something. And you get other people like to hear, you get the dog. And yeah, you die real quick, but you can get other people to transform to. It's a pretty cool game. I really, I always thought, especially with the arcade box, you play in this game, it just really sounded good. You know, those boxes always sounded good. The oh, come on, dude. Ah, uh, these guys just really irritate the fuck out of me. Even if they're just really mean. Oh, I got another guy. Really good sound, just really weird, interesting sounds, especially when everything dies. Really good graphical style. I mean, it's an earlier one, probably it's not like a best Neo Geo game out there. They made three of them, and I need to get, I need to play the other ones. This is just one one I saw. Oh, I love doing that. Fuck you. You don't get to have a sword. Oh, that was fun. So, uh, uh, Cyrus, you'll probably watch this. You need to find Sengoku. It's it's fun. Just one of those beat em ups. Grab you and your, I think it said your brother, and just play the hell out of this game. I don't think this, this one's a little earlier. It's not as expensive. I've seen some okay prices. Would I ever get an AES? I don't know if I would or not. Something else having those huge cartridges. Pretty much one of those cartridges are so big. Is they were just, they were the compacted, they were the same boards that the BMV. MVS had the MVS is the RK. Basically, you, they plugged in those type of, of boards, something similar, and that's how you know one ones at Walmart. I hate these guys. On the Walmart had different games in them. It's just a you know a duh home version of it, and they compacted it into the cartridge, a console. But uh, they, the boards were the same. I mean, it's just huge. 
And a lot of people thought, man, they had hundreds of megabytes. It wasn't megabytes of storage or megabits, like 330 megabits, 330 megabit per, uh, per spec is. Divide that by eight, that's what it really is. So at toward the end of they had giga power, which was about a hundred or so megs. I mean, I'm not I'm not gonna do this while I play, but it still was humongous to the main. If you look at uh, how to do the math, it's divided by eight. Say Crawl Trigger, another good Final Fantasy. Those games there were 32 megabot megs. There are only four megabots now if you download it wrong. So these this, these cartridges were an, an amazing. And pretty much the word cartridge was pretty much just a concealed <laughs> arcade board or arcade data board. A little bit different than what was on the home one, but yeah, this was this was just something that was awesome. That a lot of people not I never saw Neo Geo ever in my area. I think it was for just a different class or a different location, but this is just you know, I, I, I see in Cyrus get his own, you know, AES now. It's, it's, it's not hard to get one. It's not uh, too expensive, but it, it does cost a lot. And I think what really, um, oh, I've got a boss here. What really, I always like this, you're, you're fighting on horses. I love this. But, uh, I mean, the price is what got it partially, but... They kept going for a while because it was just so high quality. Ah, you bastard. But, uh, you know, they had... I mean, Fatal Fury is one of my favorite fighting games and series of all time. And they had a bunch of... They had tons of memorable games, so they weren't just a flash in the pan. They were a little too expensive. But... I think what hurt them, even, you know, overall, oh yeah, he transforms to this dickhead. Ah. Like I said, you'd have to have a bunch of corridors. I've continued a couple times. I'd go to Walmart and take me a dollar or so and play this or Final Fight or something. There we go. But, um,. I think what happened in SNK, and this is just in my opinion, I love SNK because I bought, I couldn't wait for Final, uh, Fatal Fury to hit with, through Takara on the Super Nintendo. And, uh, but it's just too many fighting games. They were taking more like this, or maybe an awesome platformers, more like Magician Lord. And I never played NAM 75, but Magician Lord was interesting. You know, they got to the point where they were just fighting, fighting games, and it got a little too, too much. Some people may disagree, but that was, I think, one of the downsides things that uh, they did wrong. And again, it's, you know, they're still a classic, and I love them to death, this SNK stuff. I mean, it's not Neo Geo. Everybody's like, oh, yeah, Neo Geo. I mean, they had King of the, they had King of the Fighters, Art of Fighting, uh, Sengoku here. Fatal Fury, man, this is the good stuff, and you know, there might be a time when I actually do look at getting an AES like Cyrus did, just to have them. Also, oh, Metal Slug, I mean, oh my gosh. You know, Metal Slug was the shit. Metal Slug X, and uh, of course, I played those on the emulator because I couldn't do our shit in the arcade, but I would go decently far. So, I mean, it's good stuff. And I, get, oh, I got this little, quote, boss. It's not too hard. Oh, yeah. Back that one up in the corner. I love those sound effects. Uh, this is a horrible part of the... Oh, I died and I lost my power. Okay, how do I? I don't even know. I, I should have done a POG, but it doesn't matter. Yeah, these these are one of the cheapest guys in the whole game. This is just this is where you get they get your quarters right here. Oh, come on, let me jump for fuck's sake. 
Uh, this is this is when you were in a kid. You were just getting your quarters eat up by the fuckers in the chain. Still a great game. I love the series. It's just a good memory for me, but it is cheap. It, <laughs> you know, it's it's a it's a quarter cruncher. It's supposed to be. It's, it's a little worse than Final Fight because really you got six 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 hits and you're dead. So, but it's just the Neo Geo uniqueness is what has good memories for me at that Walmart. Oh yeah, I got you back up against the wall, bitch. You couldn't go nowhere. Ah, uh, well. Oh, I got them all. And this guy, I just like the way he looks. I don't know if he's a uh, it's just weird that he has a cool look, that, that jacket. And that was, <laughs> I don't know, it kind of reminds me of the 80s way he looks. But it's just, it was published in the 90s. Yeah, one, hit, one or so hits left and you get a sword, so it's always lit. Of course, I'm probably not the best player at it, but... Yeah. So sometimes you can just keep hitting them and it's like... At least when you get hit, kind of, you kind of get invulnerable as well. Yeah, Neo Geo was just like the king. I mean, I remember that, that Pitbull ad they put out and good stuff, you know. Really, really fun. But, uh, you know, I think they were a little bit, almost not really before their time. I think they tried to go too far. And it's not me bashing them. They're, they're, this is, those are good memories. I never got this far. I'd always run out of quarters. My parents were like, okay, it's time to leave. Because toward the end of whenever we was in Walmart, I'd go out and play. Oh, yeah, they had Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, four-player. Good stuff. I remember one time we had a whole group, and it was like three other boys. They didn't know who they were. didn't matter. We was all playing Ninja Turtles. And people were like, are they playing in together? And everybody's like, yeah. It's one of those few games around this area that you can all play is together. <sighs> Love that game too. Had the version on the NES. It was pretty good. This is a creepy champ, but it's kind of neat too. And I'm not doing my webcam because I'm like to show show this game off, trying to pay attention. I'm finally got the emulator that let me do a window mode, so I'm not going to do a lot of Neo Geo. I just got I, this is one of my favorite Neo Geo games. After seeing Cyrus got his AES, I had to finally play this. And oh, you bastards! Oh, I hate this guy. It's just straight cheese right here. Yeah, just constantly hitting you. Those little miniature versions. I think that's like a, a god or something. I've seen him before in mythology or paintings or something. Oh well. I'm gonna change up and start using this character for a little bit. I love that main character, but he doesn't use the sword. He he throws stuff. So he's Mr. Projectile. So I'm gonna start using him a little bit more. SK Neo Geo back there. Ah, they roll up into a ball. That's just... And they're laughing at me, bastards. Hamburger. That's just a generic hamburger store, I guess. 
Oh yes, keep killing me. Dun 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 dun. Now the boss. This is where I got to before. And I beat I beat her. After this, I, I actually don't know what the game looks like. I don't think I've ever pushed this far in the game. It's been so long since I've done it, I'd have to barely remember. You kind of fuck her up pretty easily. Then she transforms into dog or something. This is... Again, these are pretty... These are things uh, that I've seen before, like in mythology, or this is kind of neat. The art style is really... I really love the art style in this game. It's... Ah, I'm gone again. I really love the scaling. They like everything. Like you die, you just like shrink down to nothing. It's like they use their hardware to scale everything. Except a little. It's a little neat touches this game had. All right, come on, you're almost dead. There she is. She was being a bitch. All the puns intended. All right, let's see what's going on here. Same thing, and it's like, okay, let's go after this guy. He's, he's pissing us off. Oh, man. Oh, the oil's on fire. Are those like oil? I guess it's oil. Yeah, tanker truck. There we go, guys. The sword. This guy's just weird looking. They're kind of creepy. They come all stacked up on top of each other. So top. Ah. This is the thing I was at where I died. Of course, while I'm putting my name in, you don't let the the orb stay on the screen. Well, come back here, you little bastards. These guys are taking more damage. You did take one hit. There they go. I guess a lot of these things are just like spirits or some shit. Oh, that's so irritating. Whoa! I'm gonna eat your corridors. Fuck you! Even though I hit you like eight times and you saw the hit, you're gonna go down. Ha ha! No, I can't jump kick either. That would actually be fair. No. Please insert more quarters. Me or SMK needs more money. Golly, this thing is... I can see why kids put their money into this game. Oh yeah, you keep hitting me while I'm transforming. That's awesome. She gave me more life. Love this music. 
I would say this is traditional like Japanese music or something, but this music now makes me just think Sagoku and SNK. Ah, I like this other guy. Oh yeah, the whole thing falls down, that's awesome. What the hell? That was interesting. Well, that's just... Mr. Quarter Eater there. Oh yeah, it's always that way. Oh well. If I owned, if I actually had an AES and this didn't have unlimited continues, it would actually not be worth my money because I suck at this game. It's, I love this game as a from my childhood, but oh, it is a quarter cruncher. So, and it's designed to fuck you up. I mean, there's probably some people out there that gotten really good at it, Protestant. Probably, possibly, I suck at it. Oh, but man, as much as I love this game, it's from my history, from my childhood. I forgot how much of a quarter cruncher it was. Do you want to insert more money? SNK needs your funds. Come now. <laughs> oh, bullshit. I should have had that, that sword. Okay, I don't think I've ever seen these guys, girls. Maybe I never did play this all the way through. So I don't think I've ever made it this far. I don't, maybe I just never. You know, I, or maybe it's been so long since I've beaten this game on emulator. When I, was, I used to be all into Neo Geo emulation probably 10 years ago. So I don't remember this. Of course, I'm old, so. Yeah, I kind of remember this. The music starts quarter crunching again. Wow. And start more quarter. I'm always am still amazed at the sound quality of Neo Geo games all this way. I mean I never played NAM 75, but I took a video on it on YouTube. The amount of vo crystal clear voices in it, I don't know what they did to store this much sound. And I mean, it's still not a lot of, a lot of space. 330 megabits is not huge to my space, but I guess it's just the, the sound processors they had. Love their sound quality. All right, you've been a pussy. Get back on the screen, you top sucker. Thank you. Getting where they're becoming the bosses aren't that bad. It's the damn main enemies he had to watch out. But yeah, I love I love SNK's sound. It's just just really cool. Especially oh, this guy looks nearly the same. What the hell? Yeah. Don't know how long this game is, or I haven't remembered. So I'll I will of course make it through it. This is just a walk down memory lane for me. And have some fun. Wow. 
Yeah, that's just this, uh... Okay, uh... I could do better, even... I'll just take the Bastard Sword. Sometimes it's a Bastard Sword. I call it a Bastard Sword because he has it... Swings it with two hands. It could be even worse. I we're dead. <laughs> This can to work, it must be very interesting. <laughs> I love how they cut some like right through their damn chest. It just looks oh shit. Repurposed versions of the bosses start coming out, okay. Pilot swap pilot swaps I'm trying to say. Ah, come on now, bitch. Aha, gold. Fuck you. Gold's like the most powerful. Oh, okay. Well, fuck you. Again, a pallet swap. Oh, shit! <laughs> I don't think I've ever, I've ever got this far. I'll never really fully emulate this game for some odd reason. That's, that's funny. I don't remember this ever. All right, hit the puppies. Um, the fuck? Come on now. Seriously, come on. Oh my God! How fucking stupid is that? Okay, come on, S and K. That's beyond cheap. Oh, fuck this bullshit. Good God. Seriously, SNK, you are that, we were that hard up for money. Oh, God. What is that? <laughs> you had to make the little... Oh... All right, then. I can't hit him at all, so I'm um, fucked. Let's see if I can get that other guy. Nope. And when I'm in energy mode there, I get hit, so I guess that makes sense. <sighs> I haven't even hit this guy once. Well, I punch you in the face, you bastard. This video could also be called "How I C I Can't Hit a Dog for for Nothing," <laughs> and that sounds horrible. I can't hit a dog. Oh my gosh! I always going into high-rise buildings and fighting games. You or, or beat 'em ups. Um, this is usually telling you getting higher up. Really? All right, you little bastards. And um. It's like Final Fight or Streets of Rage, you're getting higher up. The boss is probably coming up. So I get since that tower is floating, we're probably getting higher up. It, if, I really am wondering if I'm just getting old, if I beat this before and I remember none of it. <laughs> That's like the second or third level, or actually the second level. Because I could get into the second level with, even with Final Fight as arcade. Whoa! Another quarter. Yay, I used to have six for life with the sword for two seconds. Okay, that's... Okay, that's fucked up. Okay, that's cool looking. Okay, that is creepy looking. Like I said, the art style in this game is just awesome. Lots of Japanese influences, and the sounds are awesome. That's really what pulled me into it. Ooh. 
More quarters, please. Alright. Teenage Ninja Turtles are on strike. <laughs> oh, do they have bald spots or something? What the hell? No, that's not. I guess. Weird. How's the loser girl on ten swipes? Okay, that's horrible. <laughs> oh yeah, one guy he gets a kick in. Ah, to your face. Oh, so very much a bunch of us. Uh, this is the boss rush. Oh, uh, see how I said that? Boss Rush Podcast? This is the Boss Rush Podcast. This is our new podcast team right here. <laughs> I think that will look like Sega Galactico. <laughs> uh, just about to uh, all right, back into the tower. I guess we're getting close. Was there enough of these little guys? Oh, ah! I love how they die, all the characters in this game. It's like, oh yeah! hoo You don't need that bastard sword, I'm gonna beat your ass up, no matter what, I, what you do when you're swinging at me. <laughs> it's sad when you see one of your childhood favorite games, even though it's an arcade quarter muncher, how <laughs> cheap it is. Still a fun game. No, I, I joke around with it, this is fun. Oh, that's cool. This is this is what made this K game fun. Exactly. Whatever you said. This game was really a stiff play, and I didn't remember how stiff it is. So it's kind of, it's hard to get used to the stiffness. Oh, come on, really? Well, I knew they are going to get a little harder as we go along, but really not that bad. Wah! Okay, he's invulnerable then. Oh! No! I didn't make money for SNK. They needed more quarters. Oh man, who is this? Ah! That looks ominous. One, two, three dots. Alright then. All right. Really? How'd you not? How'd you not get hit on that last thing? That first one. Basically, you don't want to be jump kicked at all. 
well. Alright. The double swords, I think, is probably my favorite. I think they are because they... Oh, that was gold and I didn't get it. I think I'm getting higher up into the, the fortress here. Oh, there's a, a Zen garden. Wah! You die. Seriously? Okay, wait a minute. Fists versus swords and somehow... Oh my god. I hope the second... I'm going to play the second next two. Just to make this a series to sing Goku. I hope they're not as cheap, but I I can I love this game. I still love it. As you know, my memory's going to Walmart. I can play that first level and probably get part of second level, but man, it's just a cheap quarter cruncher. Some enemies like this, I mean, it's not manageable. Sometimes it's just like, no, I'm going to hit you and I'm going to block everything you do. But again, it's a fun quarter cruncher. I still love it. Oh, here they are. Seriously, this... They do not want to be hit. <laughs> and now I get a sword in. Oh. I don't know who you are. Well, that wasn't too bad. Are these the three women? Okay, I don't know. Well, I was doing good. I doubt that because it should have gone to a point where it was a boss music, so. Oh, really? Like a quarter of a second difference and I lose everything. Oh, whatever. Kick you in the face. Hmm, there's a guy back there. He's not having a good time. Seriously, they, they stand right on top of you, but you don't ever do that damage to them unless they're right in front of you. I didn't notice that. That's a kind of a bug in this game. There, maybe it's a feature. <laughs> uh, this is gloomy. Da, da, da. Really? 
Just a fuck you, you're not gonna kill me. Oh well. Quarter crutchers! That's the SK needs its quarters. Oh, come on. Oh, shiny. I got the gold. Oh. Sorry, ladies, you're fucked up. That's one good thing. Getting that gold on. Oh, I ran out of it pretty quick. Oh, now you come after me. Oh, I'm switching to the big sword. I had that shit. I went to the single sword. Ah. Oh, come on, really? Oh, well. May and may in this way, bitch, all around. <laughs> so, wait a minute, they get to be unmissable off screen? Okay. Okay, she gave me life. Seriously, I couldn't get that orb just because. Okay. Oh well. These guys are manageable with a fucking sword. Alright then. That's spinning. I wonder if I might. I think I'm up here on this thing as it's spinning. Follow what's up. I'm all up on following up on it. I don't like this guy just to run away anyway. You know. I'm doing all right. At least these bit, these damn women will. They had kind of punch you in the face, so going back and forth. Boa! I'm dying. All right. I might run out of quarters. That's why I keep doing that. SK needs their money. <laughs> I still love SK, good stuff. Oh no, trapdoor. Oh, yep, I'm definitely up here. Oh, you bitch. I wish he would jump, he would kick with that thing. I mean, why are you. His jump kick is damn good. I love his jump kick. It's like a perfect jump kick, and it's like. Uh... Oh, interesting. No. Well, we can't hit these guys. Well. Come on. There we go. I always say that, that it's, a, it's simple technology, but back then that scaling was awesome looking. And Nintendo, Super Nintendo, had it with the uh, uh, Mode Seven, but it's just this hardware was awesome. And this game actually came out on the Super Famicom, but it was a really stripped down version. 
and uh, I think I, I realized it and I was looking for it but it never came out here and it's it looked okay I looked at some YouTube videos so I think that and also the Sega CD had it I think and actually it was pretty much a arcade close to arcade port in the face, bitch. Oh, that's good. Okay, I'm not sure how I'm not... Oh, here we go. Oh shit! That's interesting, a dragon turtle. So I was like, why am I fighting one? Also, now they start talking in Japanese. Oh, tell me they're gonna fuck me up. They're not that hard. And again, the boss is not that hard. Almost made me think of uh, <laughs> Captain Planet. We're, that our powers combine. <laughs> oh, I, I didn't see a cutscene, so. Uh, for a lot. Oh, gosh. Okay, this must be the boss. I don't think I've ever fought, beat this myself. I think I've watched it before. Here we go, people. Yeah, same to you, buddy. Hoo ah! All right. So we're Dragon Ball Z in this shit, huh? Yeah, spirit bomb your ass too. Well, you should have used a Gatlet gun. Whatever. Whoa! Okay, he is pretty tough. His first form wasn't that bad at all. But a couple of quarters here in the car arcade. Come on now. All right, now he is kicking my ass. I'm just thinking what it would take on the. I uh, beat him. That was almost like two quarters or so just for him. That's not too bad. Wow, I beat it. Of course, I can't read that, but I beat it. I don't think I've ever beat this game. I think I've played it and actually emulated it, but got so into emulating all the other SNK games. I don't think I ever beat this. Well, I, I do appreciate everybody watching this. I mean, get Osiris, you watch, you watch this. this. You know, this is because <laughs> you got your AES, and oh, I'm I'm glad you got it, and uh, I want to play probably one of my most, my most memorable and favorite games on the SNK system, you know, the LGL. Uh, I wish this came out in the United States, like on re-release somewhere. I mean, it may have. I have to look it up. So, all right, everybody. Uh, this is Pikyo Gamer plays, and I just played this Sengoku pretty poorly, actually. I don't even remember how many times I continued, but this has been SNK SN Sengoku for Neo Geo. All right, everybody. Pikyo Gamer out. <laughs>